yes i am fine pretty well what about yeah. you yeah, i am also doing well fit and fine thank you for asking so we are meeting first uh, first time so i would like to know about yourself your side yes my name is saraswati and i am from mumbai basically i belong to uttar pradesh uh, my education is i am behavior but nowadays i am full time homemaker okay yeah. okay so can yeah, i introduce myself yeah yeah sure so as you know as you know my name is vijay kumar yadav and uh, uh, basically i am from bihar but right now i am connecting from ahmedabad gujarat because actually i am doing job here and if you talking about my education so i have done diploma in mechanical engineering and after that i am working in a private company uh, as my role as quality engineer So, so for how long have you been working there? Yeah, it's been around two years. So, do you know Gujarati? Yeah, I I know Gujarati. Yeah. So, are you able to speak this language? Then? Yeah, yeah, I'm able to speak this language because my schooling did in uh, Ahmedabad, Gujarat. So, I spent more uh, more than ten years in Ahmedabad, Gujarat. Okay. So, ma'am, I I think uh, I I think uh, I know very well already you because I uh, you are my favorite partner on Josh Skill. I think your uh, what the actually your name I uh, don't know, but I I think I talk with you on Josh Josh talk. Okay, it may be yes because uh, I used to use that application earlier. Oh. Yeah, I you know, but last uh, one month. I have uh, I have not used it. Okay, okay. Yes. And also, I I seen your uh, many video on YouTube, your uh, and uh, related to English contents and some you uploaded some video, uh, conversational video. So yeah. Yeah. So are you also a YouTuber? Yeah, I yeah I am YouTuber. You can say because. Uh, my youtube channels has been running uh, for one month only okay okay yeah so where uh, did you get an idea to open your youtube channel yeah, because i all uh, whenever i start uh, my youtube channels because i want to know uh, learning something new yeah, and uh, conversational video video through i can gets uh, learn uh, every single day new new so that's why i am thinking why should not uh, open a channel because yeah. i am also learner and uh, yeah so that's why i am starting my uh, youtube channel okay so in one month how many videos did you have uploaded till now uh 18 18 yeah means um, you do not upload on daily basis Yeah, I'm not um, uh, uploaded daily basic. So yeah. how uh, much, uh, how long means how much time you give every day for uh, your uh, you know practicing or doing these types of activities? Yeah, every single day I want to uh, spend my uh, more than one hour. because you know i am job person whenever get uh, time free you know free morning time i always free so that time i always thinking why should not uh, spend my more time in uh, uh, learning this language so i have you know um, josh skill so the, i am first there uh, practicing there and uh, after that i am apart from you know uh, uh, watching some video on youtube there are lots contents uh, uh, related to english so yeah that uh, video will be give me a lots so what do you think these types of uh, videos uh, as we are doing are making so it is really helpful uh, to improve our english conversation yes ma'am uh, uh, conversational video through i can uh, Uh, you know motive uh, motivated you know uh, in other side uh, we have confidence you know boosting confidence so i think uh, conversational video is uh, very good yeah and i think because of that reason a uh, lots of people have started to create their own channel yeah yeah 
so i think this is a, and every uh, person are get motivated by other person and the yeah. other person is get um, get motivated by other person so this is a means uh, we are making a big change yeah big change and also you know you are uh, always thinking about uh, we have channel so uh, how to i know uh, uploaded some video so we know first uh, we should uh, learn something uh, every single day new new thing so after that uh, we can upload some video on youtube yes. so this is a one the, you know, as we are a youtuber so we have a we feel like you uh, know like uh, we have a responsibility also because someone is waiting for our yeah. video yeah yeah so can you tell me ma'am and uh, uh, those people who want to really improve his communication skills so how can uh, get uh, fluency because you are uh, a good experience and you have a youtube channels and you uh, lots of contents uploaded so you have uh, so can you tell me something who want to really improve his communication skill so what the yeah Uh, means you are asking for fluency yeah fluency how can get uh, fluency because you know fluency will only come by practicing yeah no other key is there uh, means to uh, and uh, you can use that uh, key and get fluent no it is the only key and that is practice the more you practice the more you will get fluency as well as you know you will also feel comfortable when you talk uh, on any topic or uh, any stranger yeah right yes because you know uh, nowadays the lots of uh, youtuber have started their channel and uh, we are connecting each other and we communicate but uh, apart from that if we prepare topics and when we not only one or two topics when we prepare a number of topics day yeah. by day so automatically you know day by day we will get uh, and we will add new words in our yeah. bank vocabulary bank uh, and we will we'll, we will also able to get fluent yeah right yes so so you know uh, someone uh, i mean uh, very you know uh, i mean uh, belong in a rural area they have no uh, you know environment to speak this language so in your in your opinion how to uh, how do they speak because you know uh, they have no good uh, institute they cannot able to go any uh, i mean uh, coaching classes so how can they uh, uh, how can they speak um means the uh, one who lives in uh, you know village area or rural area yeah. and uh, means that person has no environment yeah but nowadays everyone have mobile in their hand yeah and internet facility is also available so using these facility anyone can learn anything either you right. are uh, uh, belong to village city or metro city yeah actually um, i belong in a uh, rural area uh, right now because actually i'm doing job so my company you know situated in a rural area yes but but i still i have mobile phone so i am also trying uh, you know yes. same thing because you know uh, if a person who lives in a village but if he if he has mobile in his hand and internet facility so by using that he can get uh, uh, knowledge of uh, all field because nowadays lots of uh, application are available and only need to be eager for learning anything if you have passion if you have fire inside you so definitely you will try for that yeah right yeah so because you know now uh, Uh, now lots of uh, villagers are connecting through this application yeah so they are the big example of uh, means uh, they are living in their uh, you know sometimes uh, uh, many person who are connecting from village side very small village uh, but uh, facing all of difficulty they are they try their best to learn this language right yes correct 
so yeah so you say uh, in your opinion practice is the most important if you yeah. anyone is speaking uh, fluent in uh, i mean speaking so we must know uh, first uh, practice practice as well as, as well as you know uh, some grammar portion uh, that is very important like tenses so, verb no no someone some uh, preposition yeah someone told me you, uh, you know grammar is not much important uh, if you are uh, if you are learn uh, this language you can uh, speak more because you, if you are uh, speaking so you can uh, uh, you can uh, get fluency and no issue uh, if you are if you if you have no good uh, speaking knowledge you have no uh, knowledge of grammar but uh, still you are practicing so you can uh, get fluency in your uh, speaking knowledge you can able to uh, speak but uh, suppose uh, anyone who start uh, to speak this language without uh, from your zero level from his or her yeah. zero level uh, means uh, he have no knowledge of uh, he uh, means they have in not any vocab or he has no knowledge of tenses any grammar rules so right. it is very difficult for that person and it will take more time yeah so Uh, can you tell me, ma'am, how long you have been learning this language, or and uh, and how can you, uh, how did you learn this language? Because you are, you know, YouTuber, and what do you think? Uh, what do you do about uh, learning this language? To learn this language, I do a lot of, uh, you know, activity. Yeah. And I am learning this language uh, near about five months. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so. you know because this is a language and it will not only come in a one month or two months or six months it will take time but uh, if you will very consistent with your journey so you will be able to speak this language right. somewhere somewhere we will do mistake but i think that is uh, common or uh, that is okay if we are uh, able to convey our thoughts yeah so it is uh, okay in your initial stage but as well as we should also try and to uh, and uh, we should also try to rectify our mistakes right because through this application we most of the time connect with our co learners and sometimes when we do mistake so there is no person to correct us yeah so we are only the teacher who can correct ourselves also right right yeah but um, i'm also using just just uh, just talks you know very well because you also using this application but there are no you know there are no any i mean teacher available but still mm -hmm. uh, students are speaking uh, good Yes. because they are speaking yeah practicing there yes because you know it is only come if you have really passion for it so yeah. you will go all uh, you will try to uh, do and try to do your best every day yeah yeah yes so when you connect with person so what you discuss most of the time yeah i'm uh, discuss to some topics um, if i have uh, any topics i uh, first i prepared uh, any topics after that i uh, talking with him uh, any topics just like rural area and village cities and uh, village life and city life and something uh, i mean other other topics are also available so i am just talking about uh, some you know uh, some topics okay Uh, so i have one question uh, for yeah. you uh, if you have to describe yourself in three words so what will be that three word describe three words yeah uh, means uh, again repeat okay i am telling you if i yeah. would like to say you if i ask you if you have to describe yourself in three words only in three words 
so what will be that thing word honest honest uh, work uh, work and uh, and uh, what one uh, work on uh, i don't have idea okay i am telling you because when we describe our personality so we use adjectives yeah there are lots of adjectives according to our personality we describe ourselves as you uh, told like uh, you are honest person so you can say i am honest yeah hmm? honest another one you are hard working yeah third word you are hard working i am uh, hard working third one uh, if, uh, any uh, could be like you are emotional if you are emotional person so you can say emotional or if you are a very uh, enthusiastic person so you can say i am very enthusiastic yeah yeah there are lots of adjectives we can use to describe ourselves okay okay i got it now yeah okay i got it now okay. so uh, so uh, what are your hobbies yeah my hobbies i like play cricket and whenever i get time so that time i play cricket and uh, yeah only one hobby you have one hobby and also i now i am very passionate to learn new uh, this language so you can say uh, this is my new hobby uh, learning this language yeah yeah sure. so after learning this language what is your plan yeah, after this uh, learning this language i have plan you know i want to you know uh, uh, build my communication skills after that i want to you know uh, um, you, where i am working currently so i want to uh, you know my uh, post you know uh enhance any uh my good position i want to so that's yeah, why i'm learning yeah. this language so what do you think like uh, uh, how many times uh, you are going to take to be a fluent speaker okay so in my opinion if i want uh, if i spend uh, every single day 2 hours 2 hours so definitely i will uh, uh, i will uh, get fluency and uh, uh, i will get fluency and i am a good speaker yeah at same uh, some extent you will be a good speaker yeah yeah because you know english is a language and it is a life long process but yeah. uh, we can say like after 6 months at least we will able to communicate uh, Or express our thought in a very articulate way. Yeah, right. Yeah. So, if you have any question to ask me, you can ask. Um. So, uh, so you already all that mentioned. How can I improve my communication skills? Not only my uh, who want to. Uh, Uh, those people who want to improve uh, his communication skill so you already all that's mentioned how can we uh, uh, we uh, we can improve our communication skill so nice i am very i appreciate you because uh, you are uh, giving uh, me a good uh, way of how to learn so thank okay, you so really dedicated uh, to learn this language so oh, that's great <laughs> yeah Okay. Okay. I think we should wind up this session, and another time we will connect and discuss some. Uh, uh, we will uh, uh, do some activity. Yes, ma'am. Uh, sure. I will uh, again connect with you, and thank you for giving me a uh, good suggestion. Yeah, it's my pleasure, and thank you. Have a nice day. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.